Good morning everybody and this is your DAX day trade setups for today. So uh, looking at the 8 hour trend it's very strong to the upside no debate about that. Um, the bottom end of this week we've started going sideways big um, inside bar excuse me and uh, also some buyers coming in here but we'll have a look at that on the lower time frames. Also a bit of a crossover on the oscillators and we're starting to point down. Uh, don't trust it that much. Uh, you can see we're staying in this overbought territory. We've been here for what's that now? One, two, three, four weeks. So uh, you know that can continue for an extended period of time, especially on the higher time frame. So I don't read too much into this. Um, this is a really strong uptrend, and uh, we are sitting at an all-time high. And I suppose the bulls will be looking for an all-time high close uh, on the weekly chart. So. Drilling down through the time frames and we start getting to the three hour. Nothing really transpiring here that leads us to anything different. Uh, we can just get some levels in because this is more than likely the one that we need to pay attention to. That is at 16611. Um, probably as low as 16600 as well uh, would be something worth watching. Oscillators are flat, not giving you any indication. We did cross over with this big pin bar rejection in the middle of nowhere. Uh, probably a measured move of some sort that uh, we rejected. So let's pay attention to, you have to pay attention to your measured moves when you're at all time highs. Just by the way, uh, I just want to go back to the weekly and just put the previous weekly all time high in. Okay, don't forget to hit that like button. And uh, there is our previous weekly all time high. So the day before yesterday, Wednesday, we did tag it, didn't quite close the gap. It was a beautiful setup for that, but then pulled back onto a level and got going again. So if you are long here, I'll just move my stop to entry and see what transpires. But you do have a lot of data coming out today, so it's going to be a really difficult um, morning. I think you're probably going to just go sideways, to be honest. Um, wouldn't surprise me to see us do this just range in between these two levels so uh, 16675 and 16612 until non-farm payrolls out the way before moving but then it's too late to trade the DAX and you probably just want to be trading the uh, the US markets and uh, drilling down to the 15 minutes not going to really change anything you can see as I said yesterday with a gap here we had a 15 minute level which is there Fairly decent price action there, but that wasn't too decent there. So it's kind of all over the place. And if I just drop it a little bit lower, you can see that was kind of the level that we were looking for. So there was our rejection bar, 16,600 round number, pretty much a sure bet offering. But then we didn't really get going. We just like staggered along. So anyway, I expect us to do exactly the same thing today. To be honest, I don't think we're going to have much uh, movement until non-farm payrolls is out the way. Um, there is a whole whole host of data as well coming out today. So that need to get out of the way before the market will start picking a direction again. So for me, um, this is the early weekend. I'll be sitting on the side. I'm not even going to bother looking at these charts uh, today. Hope that it helps and uh, we'll catch up with you on Monday morning. Cheers for now.